So as of the time of this recording, I've been spending about the last, I have to figure this out actually, I would say 57 years, that's kind of scary, but 57 years selling stuff. Now, truth be told, the first 10 years were in my dad's retail store. Customers would come in and they'd want to buy a package of socks or underwear and I was in there to try to sell them a sport jacket or a pair of shoes or maybe some new jeans or whatever the case may be. But I learned a lot in those 10 years of sales from my dad as well as the other people that were selling in the store. But from that point on, from the time I was 22 when I got my first job as a sales junior um, in the computer business, selling cloud-based services, although we, didn't, we weren't smart enough to call them cloud-based services, it was an online service bureau, I've had the opportunity to learn a tremendous amount about sales and sales management and work habits and discipline and determination from some people that really are the people that I followed. And I want to share some of that with you today. So there are two phrases that immediately come to mind for me that I've thought about throughout many of those years. And the first one, and I'm sure that I read this, I didn't hear it, but I read it. Um, and, and, and it goes, I'm pretty sure I got the words exactly right which is, hard work does not guarantee success. If it did, everyone would work hard. But not working hard guarantees failure. And that's a tough one to take in when you're trying to sell something and your comfort zone is if I work hard enough, if I work hard enough, I know that I'll be successful. And when you realize that it isn't the guarantee of success, you know, there's a reckoning that goes with that. But it's really important because there will be some of you out there right now that are working your ass off and you're not finding success. And you may be ready to kind of throw your hands up and say, well, this doesn't work. And the answer is, yeah, <laughs> it doesn't necessarily work. But it's the only choice you've got. Because if you take the other route, you know what the results are going to be. So let me give you the corollary to that before we move on to anything else. And that is, work works. If you do what you need to do, if you step in there every day and you do what you need to do, you'll be successful. I can't tell you when, I can't tell you how much, but you'll be successful. And the third piece of that puzzle, and this was told to me by my first professional sales manager, a fellow by the name of Larry Glassman, who said to me when I was 24 years old, and he said, you know, Bobby, this ain't baseball. We don't care about your batting average. All we count are hits. If it takes you more at bats than anybody else, nobody cares. All we care about are the hits. So those are three things that I want you to think about and take that as some wisdom and some wise words from a wise guy.